Welcome back to another episode of Que Pasa. I'm joined here as always by Lauren Falco from Destination El Paso. We got our coffees ready and that is because we are currently at the Desert Moon Emporium here on Mesa. Lovely spot. The coffee is even better. Uh, Lauren, tell us some more. I'm, I'm honestly, I'm floored because I'm drinking coffee without any kind of creamer or milk, which is usually my standard. Uh, but this is definitely a place you want to drink it first before you add. It's, it's a great place that has a roastery in the back. They roast all their own coffee beans. You can buy whole beans here. And this guy's been in the game for 20 years. So, I mean, the owner and his wife are extremely, extremely talented and very passionate about coffee. So I think this is a place that you can come to really try something different and try something new in El Paso. And separately too, they have a lot of really great gifts. They also focus on baskets. So like if you want to come in, make all this like local basket for, you know, people who are coming in, it's just a really great space. All right, Lauren, let's get to our events. International is actually having quite a few events going on. First of, first of them is for uh, all of you single people out there. Maybe you know someone who is single and want to help them out. Yeah, so they have actually done this event uh, for, for a couple of years now, but it's a Date Them series. So, you know, we've heard of like singles, like meeting singles night. Uh, this is a great event where you can actually pitch yourself or a friend uh, at this event to other singles. So it's really cool, it's on July 31st at International. They have another event happening as well uh, relating to tacos. Yes. What about that one? So everyone knows Look It Up. It's at International, it's inside International on the first floor. We featured it. We featured it, it's delicious um, and their specialty is vegan. So they're doing an artisanal vegan taco series every Thursday, and they're gonna do it at, on August 1st at International, inside International Bar. Uh, we have a bigger event at Don Haskins as well this weekend. Aventura, tell us about it. I have to do this when yeah, I say it. Aventura. Aventura. <laughs> um, it's a bachata group, it's Grammy nominated, and uh, it's gonna be happening at the Don Haskins on July 30th. Go check that out. It's a, it's honestly one of my favorite things about going and seeing those kinds of events is even if you don't really know the music, it's still danceable and it's like fun. So, it, you know, even if you're not a fan, maybe you'll be a fan. We have another really huge event happening this weekend as well. It's been happening for many years here in the borderland. It is the Summer Days of Remember Remembrance Bridal Quince Sweet 16 Expo. You have everything you need there. Tell us about it, Lauren. Yeah, so this is actually its 18th uh, Expo, which is really cool. Elegant Penguin puts it on um, and it's a really, it's a huge expo as you mentioned, but it, it covers kind of the gambit of like special occasions. So bridal, quince, sweet 16, um, but it's really good for just party planning in general. If you're, if you're looking to plan a really big party for an event, that's happening on August 4th, Sunday, August 4th at the El Paso Convention Center. Awesome, Lauren, thank you so much. Sure. Uh, once again, if you wanna look at any of these events and numerous other ones, you can go to visitelpaso.com and we'll see you again here on Que Pasa next week.